All right, Coach, a pretty nice day. Had a couple of champions. Um, you know, talk about, you know, coming in and what you really wanted to see from your guys. Well, the biggest thing that we talked about all week long is just competing for seven minutes and getting everybody to uh, get better every time they step on the mat. And uh, I think in a lot of places we did that. And, you know, it, it's, it's about the, the journey. It's not about just this tournament. It's about the whole year. It's about their career. And uh, I think a lot of the guys made uh, a lot of progress today. So Drew Hughes' match was pretty big. He's, he's down, he gives up a couple of takedowns, and then he gets on top. And he said that, you know, he hadn't been on top yet, and that was kind of the X factor of the match. And, you know, he's really, really good on top, and it really showed in that match. How confident were you guys once he got his choice in the third period? You know, I mean, this is big-time college wrestling, and uh, we see what he does every day in the room, and you assume it's going to carry over, but until he's put in that situation in a big-time match, you're not sure. Um, I, I am very confident in Drew and his abilities, especially in the top position. And uh, he's a guy that's uh, going to um, challenge people all, all year long. And, uh, you know, he was, he was in a position where, you know what, with one turn he was going to tie that match or if not take the lead, and that's what happened. And uh, I mean, that, that is his best position. And, uh, you know, he, he, put him, he gave himself a chance to win the match. Mm -hmm. Now, Javier is one of your, your your leaders on the team, and he says that he's been trying to lead by example, but really get a lot of the young guys to lead themselves. You know, do you look to him to be that kind of a leader in, in this type of atmosphere? You know, Javier is um, he's a guy that uh, you point to as a program leader because he does everything right. Uh, he works hard. He doesn't take shortcuts. Um, he doesn't get caught up in the social aspects of life. And uh, he's passionate about what he's doing, but he also has a level head um, about you know what he's trying to accomplish along the way. So I think guys identify with that and uh, kind of want to follow follow his lead. So you know he, he's an easy guy to point to as a you know as a head coach look, looking to the guys. I think uh, he's a guy that's just going to be a true leader for the program. So you guys have had a couple of competitions now, and obviously each time out you want to see your guys improve. Have you seen them improve each time they get on the mat? I would say overall, yeah. Um, you know, obviously you could always point to one or two guys where you're going, gosh, I wish this would have happened. But uh, we had 31 guys compete today, and I, I would say the overall situation is that we got better from two weeks ago. All right, Coach. Well, good luck throughout the season, and uh, thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Thanks, folks.